working with a group of five on garden days when people are yeah. on the River Road Gardens. They join, that makes 10 people. Um, and when the park was developed, sometimes we bring things in after we, we, we're done working, we sit in the park and have our treats and talk and that's all, also a lot of fun. People are really grateful and thank us all the time and yeah. tell us stories about the bridge or ask us a lot of questions and are always really grateful for what we do. And we have regulars, regular bikers who come by and stop and talk and it's really nice. Yeah. It's really, yeah. really rewarding to work there. Every week the flowers are so beautiful, butterflies are there, hummingbirds. Um, we see birds in nests up on top of the bridge. It's really beautiful. We see bald eagles sometimes, mm -hmm. um, kingfishers, people having a lot of fun in their kayaks, or the crew practicing. Yeah, basically we find that we do need a lot of computer work, and it's mostly spreadsheet work, Excel, but it's pushing the boundaries of what Excel can do. And as you can see from the stack of papers, it takes a lot to plant all of, to plant and order all of the flowers. Uh, in addition to that, we need to look into website development. I think eventually the bridge needs to have their own website um, and we need to figure out how to develop it, how to build it. Um, and then how to maintain it. In, uh, also, uh, QR codes are the, the really direct way to get information and we need to uh, somebody who knows how to set those up for us, how to get them going. Um, because there's a lot more information out there on social media uh, we need people who are much more savvy than those of us who are older in how to set those up, how to really post to them in a way that's effective and grabs people's attention. So there's a lot more on the bridge than the flowers. And I think the more the bridge becomes known and people are coming from all around, we've got to get better um, in getting out the word. We have a website that is through uh, the town of Simsbury uh, and there is some information there. Otherwise, I think in the display case, we usually have email, mm -hmm. my name and whoever else. And all the volunteers refer people to Jan if they're asking while they're watching us work and say, gee, I'm interested. Should I do that?